What's going on folks, Ted from Nerd Immersion here, and I just wanted to go over something real quick because we have the, so many people are confused about different aspects of the new player's handbook, and somebody, uh, Thomas Christie, aka at D20Play over on Twitter, posted uh, basically the intro page of the character classes, and I wanted to showcase it because some of you are curious about subclasses being provided in the 2024 Player's Handbook, and this image kind of just showcases it all here for you. So as you can see, uh, it states here, the Barbarian will have the Berserker, Wild Heart, World Tree, and Zealot. Uh, several of those we'd already seen. World Tree is one of the wholly brand new subclasses being contained in this book. Now, it's not wholly new. It was... Uh, I think one or two versions of it did appear in the Unearthed Arcana, but it is a new, like, it doesn't exist in a different book. It wasn't, like, updated and ported to the 2024 book. The Bard, we have Dance, Glamour, Lore, and Valor. Again, Dance being one of the new subclasses. The other three appeared either in the original 2014 Player's Handbook or, and then again, either Tasha's Cauldron uh, I believe most of these are all come from Tasha's Cauldron if they weren't in the original book. Cleric, we have Life, Light, Trickery, and War Domain, all from the 2014 Player's Handbook. Druid, we have Land, Moon, Sea, and Stars. Sea Druid being the one br other brand new. So that we've already covered the three wholly brand new subclasses in just, you know, for this book, which again was the World Tree Barbarian, Dance Bard, and Sea Druid. Fighter, we have Battlemaster, Champion, Eldritch Knight, and Psy Warrior, three from 2014 Player's Handbook, one from Tasha's Cauldron. The Monk, we have Mercy, Shadow, The Elements, and The Open Hand. The Elements is the new version of the Four Elements Monk from 2014. Open Hand and Shadow, again from 2014 Player's Handbook, Mercy from Tasha's Cauldron. Paladin, we have Devotion, Glory, The Ancients, and Vengeance, again, taking everything from 2014 and adding Glory. Ranger, we have Beastmaster, Fey Wanderer, Gloomstalker, and Hunter. Again, mixture of 2014 and then also other supplements, which again, I believe is also Tasha's Cauldron. Rogue, we have Arcane Trickster, Assassin, Soul Knife, and Thief. Again, originally this was supposed to be Swashbuckler, and they dropped Swashbuckler in favor of Soul Knife. So probably the easiest one, if you want to update it yourself, would be the Swashbuckler, as a version of that already exists in the Unearthed Arcana. Sorcerer, we have Aberrant Sorcery, Clockwork Sorcery, Draconic Sorcery, and Wild Magic. Warlock, we have Archfey Patron, Celestial Patron, Fiend Patron, and Great Old One Patron. And lastly, we have Wizard, Abjurer, Diviner, Evoker, and Illusionist. Again, just changing the names from the school-specific names that we had, kind of making it more of a person rather than like an abjuration school. It is now Abjurer. So for those of you curious what the subclasses are going to be in the 2024 Player's Handbook, those of you also looking and hoping for Artificer, officially confirmed, has been for a while, Artificer will not be in this book, though it will likely appear in some sort of future source book. Hope this clears up any of the confusion you might have had about what you'll expect to see. But hey, again, there are three brand new subclasses in here that we haven't seen elsewhere, which is pretty cool. Uh, but yeah, anyway, let me know your thoughts and opinions in the comments down below, and I'll see you all next time.